Yo yo, what's up everybody? Chevalio here. Welcome back to the channel. Thank you for stopping by again. I believe my last video was maybe two months ago. I was hoping for some good news by the time I made my next one. Unfortunately, it took a while. However, I do have good news. I finally hit Diamond 5, just like I said I would, just like I knew I would. Uh, unfortunately, I do have a, a little confession to make. I had to spam top lane to get to Diamond 5. Um, I wanted to hit Diamond 5 as a mid lane main, mostly for Nivea, Cassiopeia. However, I just spam Scion and uh, and I and I got into the Diamond 5. I mean, it's not the way I wanted to do it. I feel a little like a sellout, you know, because I had a plan. I had, you know, I'm going to get better. I'm going to uh, record my progress. I'm going to, you know, talk about it. I'm going to chat about it. I'm going to walk through the progress, all this stuff. Oh, man, my hair looks, it looks awful today. But uh, I ended up, you know, I got a pretty good win rate with Anivia. I think I had something like 50 games, and I have maybe 70 games, and I have something like a 53, 54% win rate, which is respectable. So it got me most of the way there. But for that last jump from from Plat to Diamond, from Plat 1 to Diamond 5, I had to spam Scion. And part of it is just like, really, it was not ranked anxiety, but there was some confidence issues in in uh, my Anivia play, like I felt like I can casually probably be like plat 3 without having to try hard in mid lane, you know? And it's like, alright, that's pretty good, I can go there. But then to make that jump from plat 1 to diamond 5, I was like, man, I don't know if I'm, I don't know if I'm really there. And I realized that I was uh, doing pretty well when I had to uh, give up mid lane. Well, not, I didn't have to give up mid lane, but I uh, gave up mid lane just to, you know, be a team player. And I was like, oh snap, I can... I'm doing alright at Scion. <laughs> so I just spammed it for the last, uh, I spammed it for the home stretch and I'm at 5. I mean, <laughs> another part that kind of sucks, it feels like less people play, you know, everyone switch games and less people care about League of Legends and the season has been just crazy nonsense all over the place. So it's like, man, I hit, <laughs> I hit Diamond 5 in the season no one cares about. But, uh, I mean, I'm not going to get too down on myself, you know, because it's still an accomplishment. I still feel pretty good. I'm still, uh, let's see what the OPG says. Sorry about this. I usually don't. I'm not usually on the internet when I'm recording, but I am today. Sorry about that. Okay, so I am in the top 1.78% of NA. You know, that's pretty good, right? Uh, but also, it really puts in perspective how, like, Diamond 5 is the is the Bronze 5 of, like, the top 1 point, the top 2%, you know? So it's like, it's like when you graduate from college and you learn, and you just realize how behind you actually are on everything. So like, yeah, I hit Diamond 5, like, oh, snap, now I have to actually get really good to keep, to keep climbing. So, but, we're here, we did it. You know, we had a goal, we said we were doing it, and it's there, you know, that's how it works. Um, I, uh, another part I'm a little disappointed in is, um, sort of like the learning part of it, you know, after all, like, I felt like I was able to climb without much issue, you know, and I had to make tweaks here and there, you know, I had to improve my warding, I had to improve just my general awareness, I had to... Uh, improve my team fighting, or it's a different kind of team fight, different kind of a, you know, your role as a mid laner is often different from your role as an ADC, which I used to main. Like, ADC is like, just do damage, unless you're playing like, Ash, and it's like, hit your arrow and do damage, you know, but with mid lane, you had to, sometimes it's zoning, sometimes, you know, there's a control aspect to it, there's a, sometimes you want to play an assassin, sometimes you want to play like, your DPS, sometimes, stuff like that, you know? So I had to learn a whole bunch of little things, but I never felt like I made that jump from, like, to the point, like, I can't say, oh, do this and you will climb as well, you know? Because there is, it's really a lot of it is, like, play better. Play, look at the map, uh, stuff like that, you know? Things that you would tell someone in Bronze 5 to do, to improve. But, like, the difference between Plat and Diamond, I haven't, I haven't really made that jump besides my rank, my, uh, 
besides the lead changing, besides my border up getting upgraded, I haven't really made that that knowledge jump, you know, or that skill jump. I haven't really accomplished that, which is something I really wanted to do. Like I want to be able to pinpoint the area where I improved to become diamond, you know. So I didn't get that. And I, I mean, I'll keep. I keep. I still watch a lot of uh, replays. I still watch a lot of uh, Korean streams and all this stuff. And I'm still trying to figure that part out, you know. And I that'll be the next step. I want to be able to. I want to be able to. I guess coach somebody to, into getting better, because I mean that's one of the. That's one of the things they say to when you really want to learn something or you really want to Im improve on something, you have to learn it so well that you can teach it too, you know. So I might, oh, sorry. so now that I'm, you know, Diamond 5 and I guess my, people might think my opinion matters now, now I really want to get to a point where I can watch someone's replay and say, okay, improve here, here, and here. And then, you know, I can internalize that and then I can apply it to myself. Or maybe it should be the other way around. You know, I should apply it to myself and then try to teach it. Well, either way, the point is I, I need to grasp that, uh, the, the right concept. I need to. I need to learn how to get better. That's still number one priority. Because, you know, a lot of it, you know, I said I was going to be Diamond 5, but I also said that we were going to play with the mentality that we're trying to improve. You know, not just a matter of playing a game after game after game after game after game, but sitting down, looking at the gameplay, uh, ignoring the win-loss, and just saying, what can I do to play better? And that's, and I said it before, and that's how you climb, you know? Like, the the league ladder isn't isn't just about the game isn't to play and climb, believe it or not. You know, it could be your goal, but the game itself, it wants you to win one, to lose one, to win one, to lose one, to win one, to lose one. So when you're winning and losing, like, pretty regularly, you're where you are. You are where you should be, according to, you know, the ladder. Going beyond that is actually where it's difficult, because uh, you get so stuck in this rut of just playing game after game that... Like you're just hoping for a win, and that's not. <laughs> I think I'm pretty sure I said this before, and that's not how you get better. You, know, you get, and that's not how you climb. You know, you get you climb by getting better. You get better by making a conscious effort to play better. You know, the the LP just comes naturally after that. So, I think. Uh, oh man, there's there's always things I want to do, but I never end up doing them. Like just on a. Well, not necessarily personal, but I learned I got uh tiered up in Amazon merch, which is pretty cool. I went from 100 slots to 500, and that's uh pretty awesome. However, <laughs> now I'm in, I'm kind of burned out, and I'm not even uploading right now, and that sucks because you know that's uh, not free money, but that's extra money that you can be making, and I'm just like, eh, that kind of sucks. So I accomplished one goal. My next goal is going to be to get all 500 slots in Amazon merch. Uh, uh. Uh, build up then my other goal is going to be just to stream I haven't streamed probably in two months I haven't streamed my gameplay just because I feel I play a lot better when I'm not streaming it's like which I'm not sure why like I'm not necessarily I don't think I'm doing anything I think it's the talking out loud like I think I have to really like just be in the moment to play well you know and I think I go for dumb stuff when I'm streaming just to try to make it a better stream so I turn my stream off I concentrate on uh, ranking up and we did it but I want to get back into streaming oh, man I think I'm gonna offer some like free coaching maybe and then uh, upload those to the channel I don't know I mean <laughs> I really haven't done much with this channel at all this year um, I don't even know what my goal was I think I wanted to make like a let's play channel I ended up doing mostly League of Legends videos uh, I mean it is uh, it is what it is you know a lot like I said before a lot of these are more for me not really for entertainment purposes I could go back and see where my head was at I can go back and uh, see if I actually learned anything which I which I must have right because I went from gold mid lane last season when I switched diamond 5 well diamond 5 with a little carry at the end Diamond five, but um, a lot of things I have to, a lot of things I have to work on. A lot of things I have to do. I have to set another goal so I can crush it, and then uh, then move on from there.
Oh, uh, one more thing. Sion got a little buff, so he's kind of strong right now. I think they they upped his uh, they upped his health per minion up by like one, right, from three to four, which isn't a lot, but when you think about it, like twenty minutes, you like casually at twenty minutes, you'll have one. Like, I mean, unless you're really good. Like, I have around one. I want to say maybe one eighty. 170 minions that's already an extra 170 health I, that's not even counting the the siege minions but i think i got 10 or 15 something like that right so that's a lot of health for free i mean and so i think scion is just strong right now so abuse him if you want you know free lp yeah i think you can play mid lane too top or mid lane mid lane obviously you still go tank but build a just just keep pushing don't let them don't let them off their tower i mean, sorry just <laughs> play tangent um, and to main point of the video, of the vlog, Diamond 5, we, we made it. Right. Anyway, uh, that's all for right now. Next video, I don't know, man, like, in a week. Let's say a week. Let's see. Hopefully it's under two months, but we'll say in a week. All right. GG's, thanks for stopping by. Appreciate it. Peace.